No. Both. It depends. So obviously being in the business, we've seen a lot of fluctuations in the real estate market the past couple of weeks. And a lot of our clients are coming up to us asking us if there's going to be a crash soon. Um, all signs are pointing to there's not going to be a market crash like there was in 2008. We are seeing a tremendous slowdown, which needed to happen. But 2008 was a little bit different. Now people have record levels of equity in their homes and obtaining a loan is a lot more strict than it was in 2008, which caused the crash at that time. Yeah, another reason there's not going to be crashes, there still is demand. So when the market was crazy early this year, it was high demand and also low rates that was filling the market. Now that rates have gone up, the demand has cooled, but there's still plenty of people out there that need a house. So we're not going to see a crash because of that. So if you've been following the current real estate market, you know that rates have increased quite a bit over the past couple of months. And this is starting to stabilize the market, giving buyers more of an advantage than they had the past couple of years. So nobody really can predict if rates are going to keep going up, going down, or stay the same. That's a hard thing to really answer. But the fact is, even with the rate increase, buyers have a better opportunity now than they did the past couple of years to buy a house they want, negotiate the price, and keep all their contingencies intact. Great point. And also, the Fed raising the rates doesn't necessarily impact more just rates directly. So keep that in mind when you hear the Fed has raised the rates like today. That doesn't necessarily impact mortgage rates. They're tied to other things. So we're going to see a little bit of volatility of ups and downs of mortgage rates. At some point, they'll probably go down. We don't know when that's going to be. Uh, so don't base your buying or selling based upon rates. Is now a good time to buy or sell? That's a little bit of a challenging question because everybody's situation is so different that we really need to sit down with you to see if now is the right time for you. It's the biggest decision you're going to make, um, the biggest purchase you're going to make. So we want our clients to be 100% ready for it and just mentally prepared, financially prepared. So I think sitting down talking with us, talking with a lender to see where you stand and getting that first step done is always what you need to do to see if you're ready to make the move. And we know there's a lot of fear right now, understandably so. So we want to be here to help ease your mind, answer all your questions. Sellers, it's going to be a little bit of adjustment. Your home's not going to sell in five minutes like it did before. Uh, we need to set the price correctly. Buyers, we understand you may be apprehensive about what's going to happen in the future. But always remember that real estate is always going to go up in the end. You're always going to win. Now, there's always fluctuations and dips. We, you know, we've seen crashes before, but we don't expect anything like that right now. So thank you for your trust, and we'd love to talk to you about uh, your buying and selling in the near future.